What instantly ruins a burger for you? I once ordered a breakfast burger that was advertised as having, among other toppings, egg. I imagine a nice fried egg or at least a scrambled egg patty of sorts. No, the monstrosity that came out had a quartered, hard-boiled egg on it. Just terrible what self-respecting chef would serve that. Watery old lettuce. One time I got a burger with terrible lettuce. It tasted like it came straight out of a lake. From then I avoid that place saying they have lake lettuce lol. When the patty slips out the other side. Wet untoasted bun. Poor construction. When it flies out the other end. Stick everything together with a blob of sauce. People that want to talk while I'm eating a burger. Being too big to fit in your mouth. Pointless. Might as well just throw it all on a plate and call it deconstructed burger. Excessive height. When they cost $20. I do enjoy sauces on a burger, but to a point. If I end up having to hold a soggy mess, I'm not going to enjoy the burger nearly as much. Also tall burgers. The two also go together to make an awful burger experience. If I can't bite it without the entire thing losing structural integrity. Related, giant patties suck. Multiple thin patties are the way to go if you want a meaty burger. A bad tomato. Tomatoes can be great when they are fresh and crisp. But when they are all soggy, they ruin anything they touch. Unmelted cheese imagine taking your first bite and everything is warm and fresh, then your teeth hit a fucking ice block. When the tomato has that hard area in the middle the core I guess. Gross. Fibrous and hard tomatoes. Warm lettuce. Nothing kills a burger faster than a bad tomato. Bits of bone I regularly bite down on these at Camino. I kept giving them the benefit of the doubt and tried again multiple times but I haven't been back in a while because of it. Ship mayonnaise. A dry bun or too much bun. Can't fit my hand around it, not to mind my mouth. If the bun is soggy. That means they either used way too much sauce, or didn't let the patty rest enough. All around a bad sign. When there is much stuff in there you take a bite and it goes everywhere. Too thick of a burger. A crispy edged smash burger always hits. Pickles when I asked for no pickles. Soggy lettuce. Spoiled condiments. Thick cut tomato. Stringy onions. Too many sauces. Truffle oil and or truffle aioli. Thick onion slices. Giant slice of tomato. Doesn't add any taste, just water. To summarize most comments in the thread anything you didn't order explicitly. When you put 5L of sauce. If I wanted a wet bun to eat, I would ask my neighbor Brittany, not torturing a burger. The meat is raw woo. Cucumber. If it's overcooked. Ketchup. I know, terrible person. Spring mix for lettuce instead of normal lettuce. Tomatoes. I really don't like tomato. Untoasted buns and too much sauce. Unstoasted buns I really hate on homemade burgers, they get wet asf and makes eating it horrible, nothing is worse than eating soggy buns. Too much sauce just makes a mess, the sauce just falls off the hamburger and makes a mess in case you don't have a plate. I also think glass shards make it bad. It's too crunchy for me. I don't like barbecue sauce on a burger. Mold, but that probably ruins most foods for me. Human limbs. Puts me right off. Hair. Soggy bread. But the tomato is soggy and the bun is wet beyond repair. 
when a place uses buns that have eggs in the ingredients. Such as brioche buns. I'm allergic to eggs. Also mayonnaise. For the same reason. Soggy as lettuce especially if it's Roman. Just no. Raw onions. Gherkins. Just not a fan of them. No plate. Ah oh, we want plates. Mustard. Semen. Olives. Edit not that I ever found them in a burger, but if I did I'm sure I'd become physically aggressive. If it's extremely greasy. Wet bun. Hair. Beetroot.